Bishop Cuthbert is dead. What? Cuthbert is dead, murdered. Murdered? By who? By Lord Hagman, in the cathedral. Where is Hagman now? Here, in the chapel. Hello. Hagman! How dare you? Sire. In all of this world, there can be no justification for murdering a servant of God in his own house. And now, still drenched in the martyr's blood, you come and defile this holy place too. Surely to God you do not mean to try and defend yourself. I killed Cuthred because he and the other bishops, clergy, and several of your leading aldermen formed a conspiracy to overthrow you. And then, to assassinate you for your attacks on the power and privilege of the church, which they think has only just begun, for your offer of friendship to pagans, and for your weakness. I felt I had no choice but act, to save both your crown and your life. Did he tell you who else was involved in the conspiracy? What are the bishops? Aldermen? No. Only that Cuthred was at the heart of it. And he told me that if I now restored him to the bishopric of Sherborne, then he might easily identify the others. But if you were to reinstate Hakeman, it would cause the greatest outrage and resentment, especially in the church. Even so, Mother, Hakeman has possibly shown himself to be my greatest supporter. This is true. <laughs> I have to say, brother, that I am amazed and outraged that you would even consider giving shelter, let alone preferment, to a self-acknowledged murderer. Instead, Hakeman shall be punished for his heinous crime. That is not your decision, brother. For I am king and I alone can make that determination. I'm not sure what has happened. No one has told us. But I see you are imprisoned. I killed the man who replaced me as bishop. Why? He found out about us. He would have betrayed me to King Alfred. And I would never have been restored. So now, everything depends on the king? Yes. Everything. If he believes that we will protect him against his enemies, then all shall be well. I'm not sure what to think about you. I'm trying to do the right thing. For us. And for Wessex. And yet now you are imprisoned. 